Hey, fish heads, Aquarius, Aqua Fiends. It's your boy, Dante69, coming at you with a video about stripping fry from African cichlids. Let's take a look. Okay, so this is my ruby green, Haplochromis ruby green breeding group. In here uh, you'll see a dominant male, which is fully colored up in breeding dress, a subdominant male, which is colored down, and six females, I believe, six or seven females. Today I'm gonna make this video about uh, stripping fry. I hadn't seen a whole lot of stuff about this online, a couple of videos here and there, read a lot about it, but didn't have any practical application. Somebody showed me how to do it, and uh, I've been doing it ever since. For me, it actually, to strip the females, actually, it reduces stress on the female because for the three weeks that she's hold, holding the eggs in her mouth, she's not eating at all, and she gets, she loses a little bit of weight, you know, they get stressed out, especially in an environment like this with a bunch of fish in a small area. So what I want to do is as soon as those wrigglers in her mouth, they're not just wigglers anymore, they're actually, um, they're actually able to swim. I determine that by time, like I wait till about second week, maybe a little over second week, and I, I start to watch the female. Sometimes I take photographs, I take photographs of the female. It'll show you when you look close at the photo. Sometimes you can see little eyeballs in her neck or uh, the fry actually trying to get out of her mouth. She's fully stuffed. It looks like she's got a neck full of marbles. She's ready to go. So I remove the female from the tank and I bring her over to the fry tank that I got and I commence by stripping her of the uh, swimming fry at that point, which I'm gonna do right now. I will... Um, I will take her over to another tank. It's gonna take me a few minutes to catch. There's two females in here right now holding and ready to spit. Um, I'll, uh, I'll do that now. Okay, so this is the fry tank that I um, recently stripped two female, two female Victorians, the ruby greens. I stripped them and put the fry inside this tank. I wait for them to grow out for a few weeks till they get big enough and then I put them in a bigger grow out tank. Okay, here we go. Yep, they're swimmers. Now I'm, pr I'm pulling the bottom jaw up. I'm pressing down gently as to not hurt her on the bottom of her chin. And do you see the, the fry spitting out? A lot of fry from her. I'm opening her mouth. I'm trying to be delicate. Filling it with water, shaking it up a little. Okay, doing it again. Let's see, get those out of there. Oh! She escapes sometimes. Gotta grab her back up. Be gentle. Get those fry out. Come on, baby. Let's go. There it is. A couple more coming out. All right. Gently massaging again. Filling with water like a cup. Putting it back down. Filling the water. And seeing if I could squeeze any more babies out of her. It looks like she's empty. Gently massage it a couple more times. Open the mouth. Let's see if I can get her to spit anymore. Okay, it looks like she's empty. Then I could actually take the fish and look deep down inside her. I see a couple more in there. There we go. See, two more came out. more. Let me look deep, deep down in her. I don't see any more. 
but we'll, we'll try. Okay, I'm gonna put her back, she's done. And there you have it, stripping the ruby green. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate it much. Happy fish keeping. Dante69 out.